I'm honestly kind of horrified with the way that it's gone, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, honestly, absolutely horrified. I never intended to be what it was. You know, I, I kind of said it, I talked about it with an interviewer um, as part of like a, a piece about me. And then when they ran the article, there was nothing in it about my mental illness. And I was like, oh cool, they didn't put it in. And then a little while later, they came out with an entire article dedicated to that portion. The New York Times ran a quote, a misquote, um, saying that because I'm biracial, my dad's black, my mom's white, um, I'm, bis I'm bisexual, and because I ha have bipolar disorder, that I call myself tri-bi. And this expression tri-bi got kind of tossed around the internet, um, and, it, and it really upset me because it's a very trivializing way to describe, you know, this, this large part of who I am and some things that I've struggled with. Um, and rightfully so, thinking that I said that, a lot of people on the internet kind of just turned it into an opportunity to mock me. Like in this way that was like, oh God, the, you know, Halsey and shit, the try-by. Like Halsey will never miss an opportunity to talk about her mental illness. Or Halsey will never miss an opportunity to talk about her sexuality. Or Halsey will never miss an opportunity to talk about her race. And I won't, because I should be talking about it. A lot of people will say, well, if you can't take the heat, you, don't, you shouldn't be a musician. And I think that's messed up. And I think I deserve to chase my dream and to do what I love even though I have a mental illness. Even though those things put me in a compromising position and they make me upset. It makes me upset to have you know, people abusing me for A, B, C, or D online. And it's not because I'm oversensitive. It's not because I take it to heart. It's not because I'm overdramatic. It's because I have a mental illness. And the fact that people refuse to be sensitive to that shows me that we still have a very, very, very long way to go. If I miss out on something because I let my, my illness get the best of me or get the better of me, I'm gonna be letting down thousands of people who really, really need me to be stronger than that.